People never really know when they see it. They just ask me what it is. They're not, they don't really have a guess. They're just like, what is that? I built the radio telescope myself. Almost there. It took a, quite a long time though. I think it took like two weeks to build. And that was with me just doing that for eight hours every single day. It's a proof of concept that the radio waves are emitted by the sun and can be measured. And those radio waves are actually because any astronomical object with a changing magnetic field emits radio waves. And the sun has a changing magnetic field because it has convection currents, essentially, where it's the most efficient way to transfer energy between the layers of the sun, and that's why they occur, where it takes material from the hotter inner layers of the sun and pushes it towards the outer layers and that sort of goes back and forth. People think that they have to follow a sort of set path, especially in astronomy where there's a big emphasis on planets and like spaceships and things like that where there's actually other options too, like you don't have to study those things. There are other really cool things out there also, like radio telescopes aren't the popular image of telescopes, but that doesn't mean they're not interesting and that you can't do cool things with them.